Hello everybody, this is Sonia. Now I'm going to do some work on this piece today. I keep clearing up this <laughs> pin cushion and then I keep putting stuff in it again. I just need to find a bead needle. <laughs> I don't know why every random thing gets thrown on here. I'm in Australia and it's going to be hot today, they say, but I'm not mean, I'm not hot yet. I'm not, it's not working for me, I'm afraid. I mean, this might be just like cold-blooded me. I've got, a, I've got a real lot of bead needles here. Look at them. I should be able to... What I need to do is just put them back in that packet over there. That's what I should do with them because I... Can't find them anywhere, all this stuff. But this is where I put them when I've finished. Okay. There's a few in my hand. Put them in this. I think so. This has got a, a few in it. Right. Open. Okay, some of these are really. Well, this one's around the corner anyway, isn't it? It's just. They're hard to sew with because you can't get it to come up through the back where you want it to. This one here's pretty straight. I, I might use this one. Okay, so it was good to put those back in there. Good idea. Okay, so I'm going to put some beads on this and some embroidery. Um, this is a, a bag I'm making. I know you need to put a panel. I, I don't know whether to put... I might use this as a pocket on the front of the bag. That's what I'm thinking about. That's what I think I might do. But I'm going to work over here, I think, on this piece, on this bit. Because so I'm going to put some beads and that around this. Put some colour in it. Uh, I hope these are all feeling good. I'd like to say hello to my cousin Catherine, if you're watching this, Kate, and to Terry Olson, who's always on here watching me work and leaves me messages. Pauline, you're always there too with a good story to tell me or something for me to read. <laughs> I really appreciate it, all your lovely comments and everything. Um, and the thumbs up the people have given me so that helps me when you know the likes and that that I get is for um, it helps me you know get a couple of little dollars to make a few more videos so I can get my internet going and make some more videos come on this is not I don't know why I keep doing this I turn the thing on and I haven't got a, a threaded needle especially a bead one a threaded bead I have those ones that's got you can thread from the middle but I don't like them because I find that they, I can always stick them in myself I can just every time I do anyway, we got it we got it we got it Pauline Becky hey, hello to Becky um, Therese I've got to say good day to all you people that I can remember your names a lot of them I see all the time so I can remember them but everyone that um, sends me a, a, a nice thumb up or whatever I, I really appreciate the, your comments and your and and things that you do for me now I'm gonna find something oh goodness me I did pack all this stuff over there it should be all in its own box but it's not a sneak back onto the table here with me I've got a um a few new bits and pieces of course I would have hey <laughs> And that's okay. This one doesn't close properly, but I don't care. It shuts good enough that it won't fall out. So I've got. To, I'm going to put something gold along here, shiny. Actually, it's ro a rose gold colour because I think it's going to make a, a nice impact on it. But it needs to have a bead on top, of it doesn't it? It's got to have a bead. Uh, I do want something that's not too big, so I don't know about those. This green one is nice, I like this. I'll get this one out of here. I'm still sorting out my beads. I've still I've only got a bit to go because I'll have to get rid of a lot of it, I think, the beads, because I'm not going to use them all. I can't. You know, these ones I I'm a collector of these, okay. I collect beads. <laughs> I got some little green ones here that should fit on the top of that. Should not go back in the hole, I hope. That'll be alright. 
I'll come across here a bit further because maybe I'll do a little flower in between. I might embroider something on there as well. <coughs> be good if I could reach them. But it's just arm's length, I guess. So you put down the first one. You don't go back in through the green one. You go back in through the... Um, these are actually spaces for jewellery making, but that's all right. They look good as a little whirly thing, maybe for a flower. Okay. Oh, I hope I got that turned on. I do, and I have the timer going as well. Gee, that's good. Oh, I woke up at ten past six this morning and felt like, ooh. <laughs> I thought, oh, my goodness me, somebody's bashed me. <laughs> I just felt so bad. I thought, oh. Back into bed, and I got back into bed, and I had another sleep for a little while, and then I got up. And I just, yeah, I felt bad when I first woke up. I had a rough night, and didn't. Well, I had to get up a bit as usual, but that's how things go. And, uh, and the cat this morning decides to run up and down the hall. He's a good sized bloke, but he can still, he can still certainly move. He's right, his energy. <laughs> I don't know if we should put this in a different place. I don't know. It has a, I'm not going to be breathing every at you. I'm sorry if I do. I do have to breathe, but I just sometimes might be. I'm going to figure out how to put something near this to give it a bit more of a lift. I'm not, seems to be a bit dull, but I'm not going to take it out. I know that I won't take this one out because I do like it. But I'm going to put something else around it. It's more stitching of some sort. There we go. Now that look cool. And they. I'm going to go back up here and I'm going to go over these bits. I'm going to just tie them down a bit. That one. Don't go through all, through all your fabric, just the top bit. Okay. I might try and work on a few different pieces through the week instead of the same ones all the time. Different people have different interests in ones that I'm doing, so... I'm going to start putting things back where I get them from. If I don't use them all, I should put them back in the... I'm going to put them back in here. There we go. Right. Now, put the needle up there. That's pretty bright. Now I have um, I have to do something with some nice thread. And I did, after me sorting out all that thread, you would have seen that yesterday. I'm going about to say to you, I don't think I've got the right colour to use in here now. <laughs> I do. I've got, I've got them all over there. There's only one thing wrong with that, I can't reach them. Now I like this variegated one. So I'm going to try and do something with this. Make some sort of a is that going to show up on there? I think it will. It'll be no, I may, might need a yellow, more yellow colour, a more yellower colour. Okay, and I should have that somewhere here. Oh, these are all shiny, though, I think, mm -hmm. or not. Um, well, that's something that I want to find too. I was going to. Something like those. Uh, no, can't see what I need in that. Mm -hmm. Oh dear, so, I'm terrible at this. I'm knocking things down. <laughs> I'm going to get something out of here and use, I guess. Yep. Or something bright. And this is. Isn't this bright? This is nice. We'll have a bit of this bright one. I decided I'm going to try and use more of the stranded threads. And goes my chair. Never mind. I'm good. It's fine. It just squeaks because I'm sitting on it crooked probably. Where's the end? Somebody pinched the end. Try not to make too much of a kerfuffle here, Sonia. No? 
goodness me, where's the beginning of this? Okay, nobody panic. There's got to be a beginning here somewhere. <laughs> if you weren't watching, I'd just chop into it. I probably will anyway, because I... Here it is. Now I'm going to have to deal with this now. I've made a mess of it. I'll have to wind that onto a card now. I'd more or less say I just want to do with that. Do I need the whole thicknesses? No, I'm going to just use three. I'll pull, use three of them. The only thing I don't like about these is they strand apart, you know, like sometimes they do, not necessarily all the time. Like the pearl thread doesn't do that because there's only one strand, of course, so but these sometimes you can see. But then there's a different effect, I suppose. And what you're doing, it makes a different, different look. Okay, now the right needle for that. Might be a bit long, but we'll have a go at it. And when you're threading it, you've got to get three bits through too. That's another issue I have. Can't seem to find anything interesting to watch on the telly. I was actually watching the news for a while last night. <laughs> And that's a bit harsh because that's not very nice the news sometimes, is it? Okay, so now I'm going to do a... Oh, righto. Um, go back there. We're thinking, okay, we're thinking. If I put something here like this, I go... Detached chain or a daisy stitch or something. There. I'll make it long. I'll go over this one. Of course I'd have to have a heap of thread, wouldn't I? Try and get it the same size. Oops, the same size as the one that's over there, Sonia. <coughs> I don't believe this. That other thing they're sitting up there. It's not pulled through properly, is it? I'm going to hook that round there, take it with me, the thread to that bead. There was a thread on that bead that was sticking out, so I'm, I'm taking it with me on this bit of yellow. I found some amazing pieces of velvet. <laughs> so that'll be I mean in my next plan somewhere I'd say. Will be. Can't go past an amazing piece of velvet, can you? Now, see, that made a big difference to that, didn't it? Putting that across there. And bits. And you can see here where I've caught that bit there, but I didn't. I have not caught it enough, so I'm going to sneak up here. And I'll make sure it's caught there. I'm going to sew it. I don't know how I've left that big loop. I'll sew my beads on. I'm, I'm always checking through my work to make sure 
because you don't, sometimes you don't see them things when you're going along. You, you don't see that, you know. You, you watch other people doing things and you can see something on their table and they're looking for it and you, they can't see it. And I do the same thing. <laughs> you know, you, you don't necessarily see everything that's going on around you, do you? I have to get my, um, a different thread, I think, for this, a different colour. Might have a mouthful of water. It wasn't very clever of me to tell my daughter to put my cotton over there. Because I need my cotton over here. Because I can't reach that. That's how things are, I suppose. I do want some green, and there's got to be a bit of green around here somewhere. There's a box. Just a minute. I want green... This sort of stuff, okay. I'll just take these out of here. They're in here because I'm working with this. Oh well, <laughs> I'm going to try to work with this bit. Okay, so I can pinch some of these out, and then when I need, I'll put them back in here. This box is not big enough anyway to hold all this stuff. Dear me, sorry about this. I'm not very ladylike today. Oh, no. These are the these are the colours that I like to use. Hey, so that's good. So I want to put a bit of green around that there now. Bit of green me. Don't know if this is bright enough though. It's not. I'll use this other one here. So I did use some stranded thread, but only a bit. <laughs> Didn't go too far, did I? Oh, I don't know. Maybe I just don't feel like it's, I can use it for something else, though. There'll be things I can do with it. Don't worry. At a car boot sale on tomorrow up at the, one of the schools, and I don't want to go, but I do. <laughs> You know how that is? I don't need to go. I don't need to buy anything. But I feel like it'd be interesting because I haven't been to anything, you know, like that for a really long time. So, because um, there's never been, hasn't been anything like that. And those um, garage sale things are supposed to be, the town's supposed to be, there's only about eight people registered to do those garage sales. That you, we're going to have a, two weekends with garage sales where people put their name down and then everybody knows where to go to buy the stuff because it's about recycling everything, you know. But there's not many people put their name down, so far, my daughter said, so I don't know how that's going to work. Is that working, what I've just done there? I don't know. Because you can't see that bit, can you? No, nope, this is one of them I've got to cut it down now before I keep going any further. Crikey. This is it, isn't it? I can cut the wrong thing. Can't see it. No good having it there if I can't see it. this way instead try to put this <coughs> put it up through there okay and get over the same distance This is. It doesn't really have to be anything, does it? It's just stitching. I 
just going to check the back to make sure that I'm getting no loopy bits left behind. Also, it doesn't have to go around the gold bit because it's next to it anyway. I think Hubby said we were going to have spaghetti and meat all thingies for dinner, lunch, and I don't think I want that. I just don't think I feel like that today. Oh dear. <laughs> uh, he might feel like it, because sometimes he doesn't really want to cook of an afternoon, you know. And um, I don't blame him. So we just had a meal at lunch time, and then afternoon at night time we just have a sandwich or something. Yeah, that looks pretty good, doesn't it, really? Turned out quite well, if I do say so myself. Look at that. Isn't that neat? Yeah, so anyway, I don't know. I won't say anything to him if he wants to cook, because he might want to eat it. I mean, so I can take one for the team, I suppose. <laughs> I, can, I can handle it. This won't have a lot, that's all. I'm not real keen on food lately. <clears throat> anyway, so there. And then I've got some orange. Some orange that I might want to put on there too. This needle's good, I like it. I'll have a bit of this needle. I'll go with that. This might find more of this orange. I've got boxes with these rolls of this stuff in them. I've got to find them so I can wrap some more on there. I do. I want to do another one of them um, weaving things on this. I love them. <laughs> I really like doing that. It's good fun. If you like doing what you're doing, you can do it really better than what you can if you don't like what you're doing. <laughs> Isn't that true? Isn't that the truth? Um, so I do have a bit of orange here. That would look good up there somewhere, wouldn't it? Give this a bit of a lift. Because that can be a different flower. It doesn't have to be the same flower, does it? What about if I do a couple of French knots on here? I do. I like to do three wraps. I don't know why. It's something that I've uh, just gotten used to, I suppose. I have to do some more green on this. It doesn't. It looks like it's half done, doesn't it? Makes a nice little size knot. This one. Just doing the three and get the fluff off there because it'll make a knot in it. Goodness. I might have to practice my bullion stitches after what I was doing the other day. I think I need a little bit of a practice of them. I was making some on that white piece that I'm doing. The recycled doilies. I really wasn't keen on how they were turning out. The bullion stitches, but those ones they look alright. I guess I'm trying to do the loopy ones and it's not working for Sonia as good as I'd like it to. I won't be, won't be taking them out though, because what I've done, I, I really like them. I'm sorry about this, but I have uh, I feel more comfortable sitting up here to do this. Just sitting up here to sew these, it's a little more comfortable. You can't so hang on to it. We couldn't get in the film, in the camera anyway. Wouldn't be in the, in the shot; it'd be off somewhere else. So I've got to get um, a bit more green on here, don't I? It's more bits on. I'll show you that. We'll do that in a second. As soon as I finish this bit. Right there. And then I'll come back on and do some more of those. I should have some thread there that colour. <laughs> it's what I was using before. 
Okie dokie. Now. Well, I don't know what, what we're doing. <laughs> I'll just put this like this, I guess. Yeah, that'll work. Yeah, the velvet samples that I found were in my linen cupboard and I didn't know. I bought them a long time ago and probably brought them home in the bag. Probably thought, oh, I'll just put some of this stuff in there and then didn't really see them again until the other day. Mind you, I don't think I know where they are now, but I'll find them. I will find them. Nobody panic. I promise I will find them. Now, that's didn't go how I planned that. <laughs> Shock horror. <laughs> um, that's not what I was wanting to do, was it? <laughs> I'd say take that out. It's only you did it wrong. I can't put... I've made squares instead of making stems. I'm, I'll, I'll figure it out. It's all right. Don't you panic. We'll figure it out. I can't wait for these 35 degree days. I really can't. I'm just hanging out for it. 30 degrees it was. Other day, maybe. Was it 30 here? Yeah, it could have been. I don't know. 28. I love that sort of weather. Oh, I do. I sit in a cool, but I love it. I, you know, <laughs> I, do, I do like that weather. I do like it. It's good for me. Might not be good for other people, but I, I like it. I don't know if this is going to look alright or not. I'm going to have a go. Anyway, and see what it does do. I can clump that all up in there. It looks like it belongs, does it? that bit. It's too much of an afterthought, that piece. I'll just keep, I'll put it in a different way. I'm going to do it, I just wanted to, I didn't put it in the right place. I'll try again. Put it down in here. Does it look like it might be in the right place? Uh, I don't know. Uh, <coughs> Sorry about this. But we won't do it if it's not right, will we? Took a while for this to come to my head, but now I think I know what I'm doing. <laughs> Took a while, Sonia, didn't it? Yes, it did. I want that to be out there. to come over this way. Okay. I'll, I'll know what it is when I find it, when I, it comes to me. I'll know what I'm supposed to be doing when it hits me. <laughs> I'll know what it is then. There might be a little bit of a mistake up that bit, but I can put a piece of a little bit of orange stuff on it. It'll be fine. A little, bit, a little orange. A little bit. That'll work. Okay. Now we do some stemmy bits on this. Uh, 
like a leaf thing, sort of. I had a feeling that was undone. I did not have a feeling that was undone. Oh, right in there. Good. I need to make some more bullion stitches up here, I think. I'll leave that like that. Needs more stitches. So I'll get to that too. I just want to use this bit of... Uh, I'm going to use this bit of cotton, which is not something that I'm known for. <laughs> i just take it out and fling it. do a couple more of those little bullion stitches up there. All I do is find that cotton that I used. Shouldn't be too hard. So yeah we go. I'll put some of these knots on this one now. Small knots. I only did two wraps that time, I don't know what that was about. Oh, goodness me. It's caught up and then they start, beads start to get loose because you keep pulling on them. And that's not a good thing. Look at that. Oh dear, oh dear. Besides pulling that down, it's upsetting me not. <laughs> You can't just do all your stitches and then put your embellishments on because it wouldn't work for me. I like to do it as I go. I'll probably try. <laughs> Nobody panic. <laughs> probably just stay calm. So just stay calm. Stay calm. It's all right. It's okay. All right. Now, <clears throat> something to give that a bit of a lift. Now, something. I don't use white very often, do I? Have I got any water in it? No, I do. I've got to have some water. But I don't know if I want to put white on there. Will that make it look good or what? You know, you don't know, do you? Oh, look at me. I'm sidetracked again. I'm like a damn bow bird. Look at this. Isn't this awesome? You probably seen me make that, did you? Maybe you didn't. Ooh. Might have to put that on something. Yeah, that's really nice, that material. Okay. So... I need something around this. I can't leave that without a bit of, bit of something. A bit of something colour. This one will do me. I was watching this lady last night making a bag. And she was using um, a bit of hexagon pattern piece of fabric that she put together I think maybe she did and I don't know if she did or somebody else but she was using that and, um, and then she embroidered all over it. These it look good. I got a patchwork thing with them and embroidery all over it. It looked really good. She, she did a good job. She did a good job.
I wish I could show you the work a bit at a time, like, I mean, do a bit and then turn it off and then go and do some more and then come back on and show you what I've done. Maybe I'll get things finished more that way, but I haven't got the... I can't do it, <laughs> OK, because I haven't got the right camera. I'm thinking about getting another one. It's, um, it's really hard because there's nowhere here I can go buy one because um, I need to pause things. If I wanted to do that, I'd have to be able to pause it and do the fast-forwarding thing. And, oh, come on, where do I save that? Oh, I got it. Yeah, so I just... I don't know. But I've been doing this all these years anyway. I don't think you should probably change what you do. You're supposed to stick to what you know. That's the septo motto here. You know, changing things is... <laughs> you know... Mostly I think that started with things that you eat or something, you know, where you buy this stuff, what, what you use and that, yes. I think that's where it started. Stick to what you know, you know, and go buy things, something different, change it might not be what you wanted really at all. It mightn't be the same, you see, so that's why we said that. Somebody did years ago. So the girl, I don't know if the girls will still take that on or not, but me and Jeremy do. Stick to what we know, it's best. Come on. Now that's good. I've got a knot. Great. Get him. Ow. Oh, sorry about that. <laughs> Sometimes you can't stop yourself from making a noise. <laughs> if you stab yourself, it just comes out naturally. It hurt and it was painful. And It doesn't make a difference, doesn't it, when you put these pretty colours all together and it gives it a nice lift and makes it so pretty. Really nice. I'm just doing a fly stitch. Okay, so you just go in one side and down through the other side and then just take it over the end like that. Oops, like that. Just pull it down. It's going to have a wee bit of work on it, I think. I did when I found it. Well, I knew I found it when I got it up out this morning. I thought, oh, I've done more on that than what I thought I did. I think that looks good. I need a right coloured bead now. Put up along there. That looks cool. Yeah. I like it. Might be need a bit of something else near it though. I don't know what. Um That's good, and then I'm going to do more of those, but I don't have the that colour, I don't think. It's just handy here somewhere, oh, hang on, could be, could be here. No, but it wouldn't matter if I used that, would it? Those look alright. What have I got here? Oh, button. Oh, good. <laughs> okay.
I'm looking for a little bit of stuff for the cluster. I got one of them. And I got the colour for me. Like that. I have to put some of those on. I don't know what I made them for. Probably, I could have made them for this. You, you just don't know. Mm. Must have something a different, a bit different colour than a pink of the. Goodness me, here's some goodies. A bit of nice ones. Very nice. I need something different. A bit of green one. Okay. Looks good. These are just bits I picked up off the table with them after I've been um, fleeing around doing something. Oh, I've been <laughs> fleeing around sewing. Yeah, after I've been doing a bit of sewing and picking them up. And uh, <coughs> Monica, I made for your daughter, wear a fancy dress one time. That's in here. Now, she hasn't lived in that <laughs> for about eight years or something. So, this is. Goes to show you how long I've just kept stuff for. There's a bird on that, all good. And there's one of those. Oh, yes, I like that too. Okay. I'm just like a bell bird, aren't I? It's all good. It's fun. Oh, look at that. What's it look like? Oh, dread. Uh, I don't know. We'll have a look and see what we think. Let's put these into a bit of a cluster. I'll put that on here somewhere later. I want myself onto another thing, haven't I? I'm sidetracked a bit, but that's all right. I'll use this yellow. <coughs> now, where am I going to put it? Well, probably should something should go there. You reckon? So, that bit. Mm, that bit. Maybe one of those. Mm. I like this. I want to embroider this. Put a flower on that. It's a button of something. Clothing. Okay. Now I want to use the one that's got the shank on it because this is a thick heavy piece here, you know, and you want to, it's going to have to come next to it and sit above it sort of thing, or next to it because this is high. Oh goodness. So it sort of comes to the same height as that orange bit. Alright. And then you can sneak a button underneath it. One of these. The square one. And I'm going to put a bead on that. But am I going to be able to get it through through this needle? Probably not. I've got a yellow one. It might go through. Come here. I don't think so. Oh, it did. Very good. We're going to find another one of those. Because <laughs> I just picked that up off the table. Um, where I can see where they are. I'll put it down that side. That'll do. You don't need more than one bead on there. Just for show. Just for the look. Some sort. Uh, the pink one. Back over there. I might 
to two, two lots through here. Okay, that's snazzy. Don't know if I need more. No, just leave it, leave it alone. Don't touch it. Just leave it, Sonia. It's fine. Besides, now it might be time for me to turn this off because I've only got three minutes on that clock, so we've done a fairly long video there. Okay, so thank you everybody for watching. Please subscribe to my channel and give me a like or whatever, a comment, and I'll talk to you later. So thanks very much for watching, and I hope you've enjoyed that, and I'll just keep on working away and doing more. I'll talk to you later. Bye-bye.